Okay, lovey, what do we have today? What's the difference between attraction and love? Well, attraction is that thing that slaps you in the face. It's actually, it's, that's easy to describe. It's attraction is the thing that hits you in the face. It's, it's also superficial, most often. It's, you know, their form fits whatever it is, the, or your eyes and your personality decides is attractive. That's why we call it attraction. Love goes beyond the skin, beyond the form. It gets down into the soul. It doesn't matter what someone looks like. In a sense, the physical appearance no longer even matters. You're attracted to the person. You no longer necessarily even see what everybody else sees. It's the rose-colored glasses. That's why we call them rose-colored glasses. Because you no longer see the person as they are. You see them as... You, in a sense, want to. It's you, you. You can no longer, you can no longer judge them objectively. You can no longer because you love them. You can no longer objectively judge them because you love them, and that's kind of the definition of love. It's when you can no longer be truly objective, you will always kind of lean and find some excuse or some you know it is what it is it's how we get through life with another person <laughs> you, you know try try and survive 20 years in the same house with somebody without that it won't work it won't work no and that's why long-term relationships without love don't work because those things irritate the living bejeebers out of you. And while they still may irritate you, you don't irritate the living bejeebers out of you. There's a difference. You know, in some sense, some of those things you would miss if they stopped doing them. Well, yes. Not horribly, but you would miss them. You know, it's not like you would miss it completely but you would miss some of those things because they're not necessarily irritants they're personality quirks and you love the personality quirks as much as you love you know the parts of the personality that you love because you can't have the complete package I mean, you can't have only parts you need the complete package and we all have our flaws and Loving our flaws is as important as loving our better halves, better angels of our nature, so to speak. We all have to learn to love ourselves so we can be better partners and love better. And that is your daily dose of love. <laughs>